Toward the end of this parsha, there is one of the most unique mitzvot in the whole Torah. The Torah tells us that we should not take down a fruit tree. We're going to be at war, we're going to be conquering land, we're going to have to tear down trees, but don't take down a fruit tree. What's the difference between a fruit tree and a regular tree? A regular tree provides shade, it's beautiful, like landscape is nice. A fruit tree just makes fruits. So if you think about fruits and fruit trees, I think there's something very unique. First of all, obviously, a fruit tree gives us food and shade. It gives us the opportunity to bless Hashem and to realize that Hashem gives us everything that we need. Oxygen, shade, fruit, food, and a regular sustenance. But if you think about it even further, who eats a whole tree worth of fruit? Nobody. If you plant a fruit tree, it's not to eat all the fruit yourself. When we lived in Phoenix, my grandmother had a couple orange trees, some pineapple trees, and some lemon trees. And even though they didn't grow a tremendous amount of fruit, there was way more fruit in those trees than my grandmother and, and we could eat, even along with all the rest of the people on the block. And we used to pack them up and ship them across country to my sister to share with people in her community too. Fruits are something that we share, we give, they're, they're, they're for everybody. So we think about not tearing out a fruit tree. It's not just a gift from Hashem. It's also an opportunity for us to be friends and to reach out to other people. Shabbat Are you ready or not? Are you ready for Shabbat? Are you ready or not?